Hello, sports lovers. Welcome to Mess Sports TV. This is your boy, yours truly, Med Chris Huber Jr. has succeeded in avenging his loss to Liam Smith. And that, I think, is very impressive. And it was a round 10 stoppage for Chris Huber Jr. The referee came in to stop the fight. Was it a good stoppage? Yes. Was it too early? Yes, too. I think the referee should have given Lee Smith a little bit of time, but nevertheless, I think that it was a Chris Uben show right from round one till it ended in the 10th round. Chris Uben Jr. started the fight in a very hesitant manner, uh, hugging or clenching Lee Smith a couple of times, getting some warning from the referee. But as time went on, Chris Uben Jr. started pulling himself from Lee Smith. Lee Smith wasn't able to close the gap between himself and Chris Uban Jr. ever in the fight, making him not being able to land that punch that not Chris Uban Jr. out. And even in the first fight, we could see that Liam Smith had that opportunity when Chris Uban Jr. was in the corner. But this time around, Chris Uban Jr. was very alert every time he went, he, he went onto the ropes and always managed to get off the ropes. So, a good fight. It, it wasn't the best of fight. I think it was a good fight. Liam Smith did not put up any competitive spirit or competitive performance. Chris Uber, Chris Uber Jr. did what he had to do uh, after the fourth round, landing the jabs at will and the uppercut, uh, throwing a lot of combination. He wasn't accurate in his punches, especially when Liam Smith was on the ropes. Chris Obenjinia missed a lot of punches and he needs to work on that because he needs to be precise with his punches. If not, he ends up burning a lot of energy and we realized that he needed to take a couple of rounds out. That is after round four, after round six and round seven. His output went down a little bit before he picked it up again in the eighth round just to catch that win of uh, several punch combination in the fifth round. So I think Chris Obenjinia has secured the win. It was a good win, but I still don't see him as an elite boxer. I think Triple G, even at age about 41, still beats Chris Uben Jr. Chris Uben Jr. Ha has now a lot of options. He could also fight Conan Ben, Triple G, Mungia, anybody available. Chris Uben Jr. can be in a good fight with them, and it would be a, 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 a pay per view fight. And it would be a decent fight for people to watch. But I still maintain that I think Chris Ruben Jr. is a hype job. But kudos to him for getting this victory over Liam Smith. Thank you for watching. Stay positive. Remember, your greatness has no limits. If you have not subscribed, please do subscribe.